It is inside this conference hall at National Agricultural Research Laboratories in Kawanda that crop researchers have converged to endorse the newly developed crop varieties. They include both grain and root crop varieties from various agricultural research institutes in the country. The new potato variety is one of them. We realize that sweet potato is consumed a lot here as a table stock, that is for, for food. And also, lately, sweet potato has become a very important processing uh, commodity. Both maize and potatoes will be high yielding for farmers. And they're also very good for processing into value added products like uh, sweet potato puree, uh, sweet potato bread, and confectionery products. It has been released under the names of Naro Maize 63. Vita, meaning that uh, it is high in vitamin A. But there is more on maize. The fight against the striga is one concern that farmers will not lament about anymore. This one under severe striga infestation you can get up to th three and a half tons per hectare, which is a significant, which should be a significant improvement in the grain, maize grain yield in the striga areas. It takes between six to ten years to develop a new crop variety. Dr. Tony Obua is a researcher at the College of Agriculture and Environmental Sciences at Makerere University. Usually for maize, uh, it takes between uh, about eight to ten years uh, to develop a good superior variety because at the end you want to develop a variety that suits the taste and preference of farmers and that really takes a longer time uh, for farmers to keep growing and benefit from. The new breeds were conducted in partnership with Uganda Seed Trade Association and Naseko Seeds. Both agree that the new varieties are timely. We are always longing for new technologies to address the challenges of farmers because as a private player, when I have a solution to a farmer's problem, to me, I think it is a good, it is a plus for me to move. So for farmers that want to quickly release their field for the next production, the long cycle, in the second season, you should plant DK Max. How far these new varieties will go in addressing farmers' challenges as envisioned? Time will tell. Henry Okrut, UBC. This is the year.